Hi everyone, this is Pete and I'm Rob from FLX Bikes. It's been a while since we stood in front of you with an update, but we just wanted to take a few minutes today and let you know what's been going on at FLX. So as many of you know, we came up with the concept of FLX over two and a half years ago. We had a tiny apartment but massive dreams about creating amazing e-bikes. You know, we were sleeping on the floor and working 18 hours a day, just writing up pages and pages of ideas and coming up with designs. But the biggest, most important factor was just our passion for e-bikes, which has continued to get stronger and stronger. So about a year ago, we were finally ready to launch our first product, FLX Bike, something we were so happy with on Indiegogo. And we were extra fortunate to meet, you know, an amazing group of backers that believed in us, believed in the product, and funded us over $2 million to make these bikes. So since then, we've made thousands of bikes, sent them all over the world, and today we're proud to say we've grown from just Pete and I in a small apartment to 15 really strong team members. We've got a new office where we've just got the space and the ideas and talent to make some really cool things happen. Since day one, we've been constantly striving to be at the forefront of e-bike technology. Over the last four to six months, we made some massive improvements and upgrades. It's been awesome, you know, bringing some of these ideas we had originally into life, bring them into practice. One of the big things we've done recently, we've taken on board a pro mountain bike rider. He was ranked in the top 20 most promising up and coming riders in Eastern Europe and sponsored by Red Bull. You know, he's got a wealth of knowledge and racing and riding experience. And it's been awesome putting some of that experience, you know, fusing it into these new bikes. So Sasha's just one of the guys we've taken on. You know, another one, Rich, who's a design process engineer. And you know, I'm, I personally, I studied mechanical engineering, but when I sit next to him, it's a humbling experience. I'm just blown away because he'll take our current models and using state-of-the-art software, analyze you know, every single tube, every weld, and tell us, hey, you know, we can make this a little bit stronger, we can save some weight here, and just optimize the bikes, optimize their performance. You know, when you ride an e-bike for the first time, it's, it's an indescribable experience the power between your legs. You know, it's kind of like, you know, you're Superman on a bike. It's just amazing. And we're so happy with that feeling and being able to deliver that to so many folks around the world. But we won't stop there. You know, we can always ride faster, climb higher, and explore further than we've ever been before. We put in so much effort in the research, the design, the development of these new models. We've literally toured the entire globe to find the best talent and the best technology available to make these bikes so special. I know there's been a few whispers, but we're finally here to make the announcement. Um, we've recently teamed up with one of the, the biggest names in the motor manufacturing business. They're a really exciting name, got some huge advances in technology that we're gonna use in all our future models starting from today. I've um, got some massive advantages. We can't wait to, to share more of the details with you. But you know, some of the big details, um, they all incorporate a cadence as well as a torque sensor. So it makes it a lot easier to hit your, your higher top speeds and also cruise at those top speeds. But also makes climbing those really steep hills just so easy, an absolute breeze. Uh, they've all got a load more torque in them and a really cool feature, the system incorporates this awesome color LCD display. Um, so it makes your, your, your trip a lot more interactive. You know, you can analyze all your ride uh, statistics a lot easier. So these features aside, quality was also a huge deciding factor for us when we considered and we worked very closely with, with this whole operation for the past few months, testing motors, checking out how they manufacture them. You know, one interesting thing is that typically e-bike motors you know it's not just a motor it's also the controller and the display three things that come from three different manufacturers and there's potentially three different things that could go wrong now this new motor manufacturer they're making all three of those themselves and so it's going to be you know way more reliable than than other systems like that you know going through and you see them make the motors at the very end there's a qc test where they test every single motor multiple benchmarks, you know, watts, full torque settings, and they even they give us all that data for every single motor. If the motor isn't up to spec, they're not gonna give it to us, 
and we can check all that in the data they give us and even look up exactly how much torque your motor has you know five ten years down the line so we're so confident in the quality and that's why we've pulled the trigger and we're going to go with this motor for so many reasons we've literally just finished building these last prototypes in fact i'm going to go down to the factory tomorrow i'm going to take some of the team with me just to inspect the final few details before we take these new models into full production so yeah really exciting times but ever since day one, you know, you guys have been here with us, supporting us, been absolutely amazing. So obviously just want to thank you so much for that again. Thanks for the waiting. I know there's been some delays. Massive apologies for that. You know, we're working on procedures um, to make sure those delays get massively reduced in the future. Hopefully we'll be able to ship bikes to anywhere in the US within two to five days. And we're working on procedures for like that worldwide. You guys have been awesome with your ideas. We've implemented a lot of those ideas into the next models. So thank you so much for all the interaction there. Really do appreciate it. Keep it coming. We're loving it. In the next couple of years, you know, just want to see more and more and, and build up this strong FLS community um, that you guys have already helped create. It's been awesome. So guys, you know, we're thrilled about the new updates and I'm sure it's a lot of information, um, especially guys that have been with us since the very beginning. Especially you, Benny. I'm sure you have some questions about the bikes. Um, if you want to know more, you know, this isn't going to be our only update. We'll be sending out photos and videos, regular email updates. So please sign up, you know, give us your email address. If you're not already, we'll send those out to you. Also, you know, feel free to give us a call if you have any questions about the new models. We'll talk about e-bikes till we're blue in the <laughs> face. Trust me on that one. So thanks again for the support, guys. You know, we're so excited to get you these new bikes. We, we love, love you. you. <laughs> one, two, three, LX.